Good morning. It's eight o'clock on Sunday and I'm in Taihefe today. Now this has been a trip I have been planning to do for some time. Basically I am searching for new old buildings, derelict buildings um, in the Taihefe area. Some of them I've spotted some of them I know they're there, but I haven't found them yet. I started at half past six, um, caught pre-sunrise, pre-dawn at Cheltenham, then had another go at the pre-dawn at Stormy, Stormy Point. Those images you'll be looking at now. And I've also uh, taken a panorama at the top of what we call the deviation. That is something I've been planning to do for quite some time and it's quite special in the sense that you'll have the star, a starburst sun and there's frost on the ground. There's frost here, It's the sun's quite warm and it's quite still outside. So that's it. Today's theme is go west the old man. In actual fact I've gone probably northwest the whole process is west of the Rangitiki River, so I'm pretty comfortable with that. The other thing that is new in this video is I'm recording uh, this video with the assistance of a new piece of equipment, which keeps my hands well away from the iPhone and does quite a good job in terms of uh, stabilising the video. So that's really it. It's a small rig frame and a couple of handles, which lets me hold the iPhone at roughly um, the correct level and with my hands well away from the phone itself. So I'll be interested to hear your feedback uh, in the comments at the end on how you thought the video was in this particular video. Thank you. I'm out um, Pukekawa Road and these two buildings took my eye. There's the old hall over there, the white building, and the shearing shed which has been flooded because of a slip which came down and eventually the water levels reached the point that it's no longer used. I noticed that they, it's still connected to the electricity. But um, my thinking was this morning that these would look quite good in morning light, and so they do. This was to be the star of the video. This little church just north of Taihefe is quite a pretty little church. Ideally shot um, in the morning and I would say on a winter's morning. Unfortunately the uh, Marae which it's part of, uh, somebody's put some cheap in there and they've muddied it up and made it a bit dirty. 
but I've taken a photo and the photo will be up now. That's it. Thank you. I, um, I'm just northwest of Taihepi, a little railway village called Mataroa, and uh, discovered this beautiful little church. And it's well and truly worth its place in the world. Thank you. We're about 25 k's away from Taihefi and I've just done a couple of panoramas including these trees here just taking up all of this vista last time I was here working I did a panorama with the iPhone but unfortunately they were all JPEG so couldn't really do anything with them but what a beautiful spot and it's quiet there's no wind and very pretty. Thank you. Right, I've just turned on to Turakina Valley Road and these are the waterfalls on the Turakina, uh, Turakina River. Beautiful. It's a shame the water's a bit dirty but then there's probably a bit more water there than what there normally would be. Thank you. Well, it's midday 
and uh, it's time to wrap the video up. I'm back home and uh, I've really enjoyed today, to be fair. Now, I'd really appreciate some feedback about the video component, um, whether what I'm doing is on the money or whether it's too much or too little. I really would like to hear some feedback about that sort of stuff. If you're new to the channel and you've watched for this far, then I would seriously consider subscribing. If um, you've enjoyed the content, then please press the like button, the thumbs up button. If um, you want to give me some feedback, do so on the YouTube page. Thank you very much. I do appreciate your watch and your comments and your likes. Thank you again.